All right. Uh, you can move it in a little bit closer. Yeah. Otherwise, it gets too distant. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, like that. That's good. All right. Go ahead. Okay. So, uh, can you tell me your thoughts on the event tonight? It was it was exciting. A lot of knockouts. Um, knockouts that I didn't see coming for instances like the the, the Gregor's fight. Um, unfortunately for him, you know, I know how it feels to, to lose in your home country, but you know it happens. So. But, it was a spectacular night, and uh, well, I came for Robin, for Moose's mom, and he delivered. So, exciting, and um, he scared me a little bit in the fifth round with uh, that, that heel kick Adam shook through, but he, uh, he took it home, man. It was a very decisive victory for me. So, okay. um, are you planning on coming to the December event? Uh, I'm not sure if I'm here. Um, I, uh, I spent a lot, a lot of time in Florida, but if I'm here, I'm for sure coming um, to, to watch the show again. Yeah, it was a good show. Okay. Actually, Roman will be fighting in New York, potentially. Uh, would you go and support him there, since it's pretty close? Like, I never know my yeah. schedule. Yeah. I never know how close I am to a fight. Or, um, But, yeah, if I uh, have the, um, the opportunity to go and support him, watch him fight, always. I, uh, I loved it tonight. So. Yeah, give us your thoughts on the Rico Bigfoot fight. We shoot for Bigfoot. Yeah, it's a little weird, you know. I, uh, if it wasn't an MMA fight, I would have been more excited for it. Um, you have a uh, dominant champ right now who doesn't have a lot of competition, so, you know, they, they have to bring in some people with a name, especially for the Chinese market. But, um, you know, I um, it's just hard to... Um, to get excited for a fight like that. You know, if it wasn't an MMA, MMA fight, it would have been more exciting for me because Rico doesn't have a lot of experience there yet. Um, but this this should be a clean cut victory for him. Do so. you see any chance for Bigfoot? There's always a chance, and that's why people are going to tune in, you know, but it's a very small chance. And I think, in, in, you know, in some occasions, certain fights shouldn't happen. Um, you know, it, it doesn't make sense for a guy to, to lose a lot of fights and everything, and then come to kickboxing and fight the champ. That's mm. how does that work? Also for the for the sport itself, like people, you know, tuning in, like they don't know a lot. Mm. They're like, how does that work? Like, how does it work ranking wise? Like, is it just like a freak show? Or like, that's 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 the image we want gone. Yeah. So mm. you cannot really make fights like that, in my opinion. No, so. but uh, on a different tip, what do you think of the idea of? Uh, MMA fighters cross over and make the crossover to kickboxing. We've seen it go the other way, but now going this way, what are your thoughts on that? Well, I think Alistair has already done it with the K1, but he he, he fought kickboxing in the past. Um, I think, you know, there's definitely fighters who have the style to do to be successful um, in kickboxing, but it's it's still a different sport, you know? So if, it's, if it makes for exciting fights with... Um, Top level guys from one sport crossing over to another sport, mm -hmm. like McGregor and Mayweather, and then an MMA fighter goes into kickboxing. But the thing is, there's not a lot, a lot of money in kickboxing, so I don't know how that's you know going to work for for MMA fighters to be uh, you know ranked high and then go over and do a kickboxing fight. So, yeah. but if the money was right, would you do it? Fight Rico? Um, if the money is right, yeah, why not? No problem. Sure, do it. All right. Any uh, any other MMA fighters that you think personally would be interesting to watch on the glory stage? Oh, plenty, but like no no real names who, who come to mind right now. But like another um, guy who, who made that transition, Sammy Shell, the most dominant heavyweight in K1 history. So there's plenty of guys who could make the transition. But um, you know, for now, I'm not, I'm I'm focused on MMA. Like kickboxing is. Is not interesting for me unless there is a good price attached to it. But you know, I'm on a contract with the UFC, so not interested right now. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Bye.